this is Leah Burke from Pulp Den Corporation. I'm here with Dr. John Kamisi, who's come to visit us from Ithaca, New York. And Dr. Kamisi, I know you spend a lot of time educating people about bioactive materials, and I was wondering, how do you explain this concept to someone who's not a dentist, who doesn't know much about dental materials, and may not have the, the scientific background? Well, thank you, it's, it's wonderful to be here. Uh, basically, bioactivity, according to current definition, is the ability for a material uh, that's used in a restorative process here uh, to help the tooth help itself. And in this situation, with the release and the ability to, for the tooth to uptake the calcium and phosphate ions from a particular material, so that this way the calcium and phosphate ions could help the, the tooth regrow and basically repair itself from the dot damage that's done from the, the cavity, the caries process that goes on. As the teeth get demineralized by the acids that we eat and drink, you know, our food turns into an acid after a period of time, and it starts to suck the calcium out of the tooth, essentially, and that's how a cavity forms. So if we can restore a tooth and put it back into function with a material that can uh, help it uh, seal the tooth, we, we want the tooth to, and the material to interact favorably with each other and not have a, a, a re rejection of our materials. 